Hello everyone, in this video I will show you how to use KingConnect or the 16 channel relay controller work with Tuya mobile phone application by this Tuya Adapt V2. So that you can use your old controller support Tuya and support Alexa and the voice country and also will support the Google Home Speak. Okay, let's look at how to download the firmware and how to use it. Okay, let's look at my computer. You can see this is H16 channel relay controller that have released in 2019, so about five years ago. But this time we will update the new life. So you can see in our phone we have uploaded this code that is for 8 channel, 16 channel, and 32 channel. And in this video I will show you how to update for 16 channel. So you just download the firmware, just this zip file and unzip and use this ESP32 download tool and download to this Adapt V2. So you can see, first we need to connect to my computer. Okay, you can see I will connect with my computer USB port because I want to download the firmware to this ESP32 port. And this is 16 channel relay controller. Uh, you can use any 16 channel controller of Kingconi product. Okay, we can open this download tool because they have already downloaded from our phone and choose ESP32 and press OK. And in this window, you just choose a file. Uh, you can see, just click and choose this H16XBIN file. That is downloaded from uh, this zip file. And this download tool, you can see, you can download from this link. And the next, you just use this uh, config, uh, your SSID and the password tool. So at the first, we need to open this file, and address is zero, and check this box, and check this call number, and click start. So that will be downloaded the firmware. Okay, now you can close it. Now you need to plug in this adapt. So I need to power off and power on again. Just do this step. Just open this one. And close. And in this window, we need to uh, set this SID and password and the control IP address and the part for, for this one. And you can see, uh, you can choose this USB port and this bandwidth, choose this one, open, and you will see uh, that is waiting for configuration. Just uh, copy and paste this command. Uh, I have already pasted this stream at this command. So this is your load SSID and this is load password. Uh, you need to uh, fill by yourself. And this is controller IP address. And you can see uh, this is my 16 channel relay controller IP address at here, and this is my port. Make sure you have set to this TCP server, must use TCP server. And this is IP address, I can copy and paste that here. Set this part as soon as this, this one. So you can click send, and that will be reboot. And then we'll connect to Wi-Fi. You can see the Wi-Fi is connected. Okay, now you can close this window. And we were ready to prepare to your application. So it's very easy. And now I can open my to your mobile phone application. And you can see that have auto discovered King Kong 16 channel relay controller. Click add and click next. I found 17 new devices. Try saying, turn off switch one. Okay, you can see the Alexa have updates that have auto uh, discovered the skill. And at last, you will see uh, this have connected H16X relay controller. And you can click. And you can see I can press this button. Uh, this relay one is on. And you can see relay one is on. This relay one is off, and this relay two is on, and relay two is off. 
Okay, now you can see I can use a Toya mobile phone to control this little controller. And at the last, you not need to connect to your computer. You use this Toya Adapt V2. I think you, if you load have the USB part, I uh, have this USB part, you just connect with the load because it beside the load, the signal is very well. So it, it just uh, supplies the five voltage uh, for this Adapt. So you can connect with it. Uh, just as nearby the route is a bad signal. Okay, thanks for watching.